What's up guys, this is your Arabic teacher Sam. Another beautiful day here in Cornwall. I'll show you out my window. See the palm trees and all that. Another beautiful day. Summer's coming here in Cornwall. So uh, all I want to do in this video is just give you guys a little bit of um, encouragement really and some advice for those of you who are learning Arabic and have made the best decision in your life to start learning Arabic. Um, a really important thing to do when you're learning Arabic is to just take time to not do any studying ever. Whilst that sounds mental, um, you should be familiar with things sounding a bit mental, learning Arabic, because there's a lot of stuff that just doesn't have any reason to it. But I think that consistently I've noticed, even students who I've mentored who have done, you know, been through the Arabic language program at the University, Islamic University of Medina and stuff, even said, like, the biggest leap in their progress that they've found is when they've taken a break from Arabic, because... You know, sometimes you're, you know, a lot of these concepts that you're learning are so new to us, especially us as native English speakers, that sometimes you you literally, it's like you need time for your brain to just accept it. Like, I, I noticed after my first year of Arabic that that after the summer holiday, I was drastically better at Arabic than I was even at the end of my first year, even though I'd spent 12 months studying Arabic. I took four months off, and then when I came back, my Arabic was better. Because your, your brain just needs time to mull it over sometimes. So even if you need to take a bit of time out of studying Arabic, don't beat yourself up about it. And even if you're overwhelmed with learning Arabic at the moment, d don't beat yourself up about it. Take a break, right? Because even, even your brain needs that break. And, and even in your studying process, I'd even go so far as to say it's essential if you take time off learning Arabic. So that's just a little bit of words of encouragement. It's something that I've noticed constantly throughout all Arabic students that I've ever that I've ever mentored or I've ever taught and I've ever studied with like you know to taking a good chunk of time out of learning Arabic has been one of the biggest steps in them mastering Arabic so take that away with you inshallah Do, keep on going keep pushing hang on in there and uh, you'll reach Arabic language goals soon inshallah take it easy assalamu alaikum